Stop Suze it. makes some pre-game show music. Okay, it is, it is the 4th of freaking July, 2017. How is everyone doing in one word? Wow! Woohoo! <laughs> Those are not words, but... Okay, Chris. Those are not words. Where, how many siblings did John F.K. have? Eight. What are their names? Junior, was this ours? Yeah. Robert, Ted, Lunas, Pat, Rosemary, oh my gosh, Dean. Did I say Lunas? Yeah. Yes. And how many are still. The audience is clapping. How many are still living? I think just one. Who? Who? Jean. Is it a boy Jean. or a girl? Okay. A lady. Really? <laughs> I don't know that. Uh, what year, what, how old would JFK be today? 100. Yeah. yeah. So he is, where does he fall in the family line? Like he's the oldest, he's Which the middle? Oldest? Second oldest. Oh. So who's the oldest? Joe Jr. Okay, okay. Um, and what, um, how many years and months was he president before he was assassinated? Yeah. Oh, really? Uh, and where were you when he was assassinated? Were you in school that day? Because I went to a country school, so we didn't have any phones or anything, so we didn't find out that the neighbors came to school. Yeah. Who told was it a, the neighbors somebody came, came on a pony? pony? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Paul Revere. How did, do you have a vivid memory of being told yeah. oh. by your teacher? Yes, I do, and I was only six years old. <laughs> It's a good memory, Chris. What was the memory? She was only six years old when that yeah, teacher yeah. took her. And then was school canceled, or? No, I think we had school at school. Yeah. Yeah. How many were in your classroom? Was Doug in your class? Was Doug in your class? Oh. Or in your room, I guess? Oh, yeah. Was Doug the troublemaker of the classroom? I'd say so, yes. Did Doug have to stand against the wall with the dunce cap on? Yes. <laughs> Doug has no memory of what Chris is talking about. He well, was there. He doesn't have a steel trap for no, a memory like Chris does. We've talked to him recently. I did not remember going to that country school at all. No, he remembers the country school, but he doesn't remember when they came and said about the president. Do you, Chris, do you happen to remember... Uh, Chris, do you happen to remember the name of your teacher? Mrs. George Henry. Oh. And was she strict? Did she slap your fingers with a wooden ruler? Not mine, but maybe somebody else's. <laughs> Chris oh, is sure, Chris. <laughs> uh, what was your favorite subject in school, Chris? I'd say math. Yeah. You're still good in math, aren't you? Oh, yeah. So yeah. You have to keep scoring scrap. Right. <laughs> Thank God. Among the other board. reasons, yeah. but. Wow. That's um, a tough yeah. Kind of tied to do you, Yeah. Do you remember your teacher being, like, upset when she told you guys about Kennedy? Oh, no. Uh, she was a Republican. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Who did Kennedy run against when he became president? Who Richard was Nixon. Nixon. Yes, Richard Nixon. Nixon. That was the very first public uh, televised debate. Oh, so yeah. who was Nixon running against when Nixon won? Ford. Oh, yeah. Humphrey or Ford? Humphrey. Oh. In 68. No, that was his running mate or his opponent? Oh. His opponent. His opponent was Humphrey? Yeah. In 68 it was. Okay, okay Humphrey. Okay. No, Humphrey was Democrat. Nixon okay. would run Republican. Right, right. What would Paul Wellstone make of Donald Trump? He would have, if he wasn't already dead, he would have fallen over. <laughs> you would have made shredded cabbage out of him. He would say that is a pickled... Uh, fiddlehead. 